Hello, friends and knife nerds. This is The Acorn by Vosteed. So I decided this video definitely, this knife, excuse me, definitely deserves a little bit of a closer look because this knife is possibly, possibly the best $50 value that there is. And I say $50 like there's values at $40 and there's values at 50, there's values at 60 and you know, $10 increments here. But this is such a good value that I am highly impressed and I can recommend this knife without any hesitation to anybody who is looking for a very good EDC at a very good price. The micarta is the same beautiful quality. I believe it's canvas that uh, Vosti tends to use. And uh, it's it's excellent, it's very comfortable, grabs so nicely. The bearings in this are super smooth. You can hear the snap of the action in there. Um, I've been using this one a lot, so it's pretty, I mean, it's ready for a strop now. But uh, the ergonomics are very natural. You just have this nice, simple, but well-designed curve here and like a recurve back here that really fits the hand very well. Now, if you have larger hands, this knife isn't even seven inches. So if you have larger hands, it still fits very well because of the choil here. The placement of the blade hole is even just perfect. I just love the way it rolls off. Now, one of the reasons you're getting an extremely good value is you're getting probably my favorite budget steel here, 14C28N. So which 14C just sharpens so nicely, holds an edge nicely, and uh, it's stainless. And you have a coating on the blade to just, you know, a little extra help never hurt anybody. So you can front flip very nicely it's just just high enough and straight out enough just even lower than the top of the knife and still amazing simple action now i have not been a uh, lanyard guy but they, it came with it so i decided to throw it on and see how i liked it and i do like that when this is in your pocket if this is hanging out of your pocket just easy instead of having to like you know it's hard to dig into your pocket because it's not but to just grab this and yank it right out quickly, the knife just comes right out. And I, I do like that. And I know a lot of people get into decorating these, which is cool. Uh, may give it a shot, we'll see. Tell me what you guys think. Should I, shouldn't I? Do you guys like lanyards? I'm kind of curious what uh, everybody's opinion is. So the jimping on this is also very nice. It starts back here, but that's because of the uh, the front flipper. You need it up there. So, I mean, it's obviously not relevant back here when it comes to the finger on top of the blade, but it's good, sharp jimping, grabs nicely. Just the ergonomics in each direction. Overhand grip is nice, underhand is nice. Pull grip is nice. Just really an excellent release. Let's take a few basic measurements here. Let's see, what do we got? For the weight, 3.15, that is nice and light. Keeping it nice and light. Now it is small. So I know it's, they, uh, they state, I believe it's 6.92 inches on their website. So let's take a look here. Here we go. So let's see, stem to stern. We have, yeah, six and seven eighths inches. All right, that's just about 6.92. Maybe a little less than 6.92, but uh, that's fine. Um, now, let me just make a quick comparison for you guys. I know the blade, no, no, sorry, one more. We're gonna do one more. I wanna know the blade length, just cause that was, you know, 6.92 and six and seven eighths are different. And they say, they say two point something, and I forget when it comes to the blade, and that's 2.9 something. So it's just about, just a hair under three inches. So it should be legal in a lot of states. I know in Connecticut, where I live, it's four, 
but I know a lot of states it's three inches. So let's make a quick comparison to some of Bastide's other popular releases. Pivot to Pivot, we'll put the Raccoon first and the Talarus. Another excellent recent release. Vostid been killing it. Value for days with Vostid. Just nice stuff. Okay, let's make one more comparison for you, my friends. Break out the, the Valkyrie. Love the Valkyrie. And I also love the Corgi. So, you can see they're all pretty similar. The Valkyrie's quite long. You know, definitely got... I would say an inch on it, maybe, maybe even not, but pretty close. And uh, yeah, high value here. You have uh, nice inlay. You can see it right there. Nice inlaid and milled liners. So, I mean, it's very sturdy. My carta just feels good. They, there's a lot of quality here for just $50. So it's up to you folks, but I can definitely recommend this knife. If you're looking for to spend $50 on a knife, you can't lose here.